Hi guys, welcome to When It's You, It Hits You. Yes, we got that right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so everybody, so um, we've been doing this, and again, with everybody's excitement, you know, um, I'm always excited when people are excited. So um, it's a it's a situation read. Um, forget about your zodiac. We just look for that very particular individual who's watching this. You can watch any of the series of this video, and then you know if it resonates, then you know it would help you. All right, and that's it. That's it. Okay, so it's about situation. All right, so let's see what's going on with you guys right here. Okay. I just came from a walk. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay. Very filthy. Okay. Need to shower. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. Let's see. See what's up when it's you it hits you let's see here we go got a six of cups okay all right let's not jinx it folks okay let's just call it as a soulmate card all right but of course you know it's like you don't need tarot 101 for <laughs> for you not to know that this is about ooh the reconciliation or the younger older but we will see we'll dig deeper okay Having the Six of Cups, um, this is an energy where um, as far as like, you know, Mercury is going to go retrograde, you know, it's a chance for everybody to renew their passport. Okay. <laughs> no, to renew the connection, to renew the feelings. Okay. I'm very partial about, uh, you know, the whole Mercury retrograde. Oh, if they came back and then during the retrograde, it's not good. We know the relationship happened when the planet was not good and the relationship is still not good. So stop blaming the planet, okay? Let's focus first on the situation, okay? Mm. <laughs> now it's like, oh my God, that is so true. Mm. Yeah, everybody's so easy to blame Mercury. Mercury rules our judgment, our actions, our choices, okay? But when you guys were dating, Mercury was not a British or retrograde or regardless. Okay, it's easy to blame the planet and it's hard for us to accept <laughs> our own choices. Okay, <laughs> so let's see. Okay. Mm -hmm. Everybody goes with a bandwagon. Oh no, retrograde, someone's coming back. How about when it wasn't retrograde? Oh no, you're dating and it's still not good. What is that? What? Oh no, is that? Okay. Got it. So stop blaming the planet. Look it within first. Three of Pentacles here. Someone really wants to come back and build a relationship. Mm -hmm. Someone wants to even start all over again with a Three of Pentacles. Because they're learning here how to be a partner. One of my fave cards with a Three of Pentacles. This is someone who's consulting wise people over there. Okay, you got the priest and the nun. So someone is asking can be, you know, um, other people, meaning like um, people who are smart enough to give advice. Okay, so if they're coming back to you, chances are they're really trying. Just saying, they're trying. Okay. Eight of cups. Hmm. This is them when they walk away from you. Ten of Cups, but they found themselves. Remember, I always say, when an Eight of Cups goes to the Ten, they find their self-happiness first, their self-joy. They had to fulfill themselves first because they walk away. They don't walk away and then marry and have kids, you know, in the next 24 hours, okay? So this is now a person is coming to you because they can share love. They can give love. That's that one. Okay. So some people do change. I've seen it. Some people change for the good. Some people are good and change for the worse. Hmm. The moon card. They went to a phase. 
they're changing. I don't sense that this is, uh, uh, you know, lies, basically. I sense that they really, okay, put their mind, the moon is their mind also. Put their mind first on what makes them happy here. They really understand what kind of love they want. Okay, I got you, I got you. Let's see. Because now they're really claiming that their mind okay, is starting to clear up when they come back to you. Empress right here. Their mind knows what is love. That's good. You know that uh, Six of Cups for me is your my, my Navamsha card, right? My D9 Destiny card. Whoever you're destined to be with, that's my card. Okay? And this is Venus. So there's a strong connection between the two of you. You're crossing path, okay? So it's not just an accident. It's not just one of those fling, no. This is a person who will make a mark in your life. Mm -hmm. Something that you will never forget. Yep, there you go. Because the death card is part of it. This is awakening. That's why you cannot forget this connection. Because you've changed also. You had your rebirth process with this person. You also started to love yourself with the Empress. You will know okay, who those people are when you started caring more about yourself. Those are strong soulmate ties because they're teaching you that lesson. King of Cups. Have a big love for you. Mm -hmm. That's that one. Under the Ten of Cups, Page of Cups, so there's going to be a communication about love. Can be age gap difference, of course, there. You got the Scorpio, you got, of course, Libra and Taurus. But again, this is not by Zodiac, if you guys are just wondering. Ace of Pentacles, very secure. Their mind is secure now. Mm -hmm. They want something stable. They want something real. They want something tangible. Took them a while. I feel like this Ace of Pentacles will be placed here to build a relationship. That's a proposal right there. Six of Wands, wanting to win also. Disconnection. Got a Knight of Swords, rushing in. Independent and confident. Five of Swords, eight, Six of Swords. Okay. So this individual who has walked away from your life wants to come back because they know what they want already. But chances are the way that this person will approach to you is not to your liking. Because with a five of swords, for you it's like, you know, like there are people who's like, no, you know, it's like you're offering me still not enough. Five of swords. This is your ego, this is your pride. But this person is already coming to what's what they have. Six of swords, you might ignore this person. Okay? And they're gonna come at you though with this offer but i feel like you're not satisfied you're not satisfied the chariot judgment see it's a reconciliation ten of pentacles four of pentacles the full card but this person will not give up they will keep going they will try more harder judgment nine of pentacles to give you the commitment ten of pentacles four of pentacles they're holding on to you regardless of whatever hurtful situation that you guys have, and even though you're ignoring them, or both of you are ignoring, they're asking again for a chance. Someone really wants to come back here. Mm -hmm. Their whole intention is really, really to, um, you know, asking for this. The first card is the strongest. Cancerian Scorpio right here. Even though you lash out with the Five of Swords over here, they tried to hold back also. I feel like this person right now is here. Eight of Cups with a 10. Trying to figure it out. But that is also their birth, uh, death and rebirth process. They're going through their own awakening. Same thing as you are already because you're ahead since the Empress is here. And for you, you know that you know, like you deserve the best. And of course, this person offering you a Page of Cups and a King of Cups over here, that's you also, it's not enough. You know what is love. That's not love. That's not enough. But this is what they have only. Here, they're thinking about this. It's a coins. And they're going to give it to you though. 
That's why you get to the Ten of Pentacles. But they don't have enough yet to offer this coin. That one is for sure. And that's why for them, they're just gonna wing it. This is like, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna take a leap of faith. I'll take a chance. Mm -hmm. In this connection. Like, this is someone who, even though you already said, it's like, no, they're gonna try again. Because they're very serious to give you the Ten of Pentacles. Alrighty? So, that's that one. I'm gonna continue this reading. So, if this is, again, if you're watching, thank you very much. And if it hits you, it's you. So, I'll see you in the extended. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Well, it's nighttime. I'll see you guys again, because someone needs to shower. Bye! I'm gonna see the details. Nine of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, and a Two of Cups. So they've been dreaming about it.